let's take a look at settings on your Chrome OS device. So if you're on a Chromebook or a Chromebox, if you look down in the lower right hand corner, you should see this uh, area that has different settings. You're going to see a clock. You're probably not going to see this icon. This is because I'm recording. You're going to see a Wi-Fi indicator and a battery indicator and a profile picture of some kind. If you click in any part of this area, it will become highlighted with blue and it will open up your settings menu. At the top, you have your account settings. So if you click here, uh, you can sign out with this button. Below that, it tells you which network you're connected to. So in my case, I'm connected to the Hampshire Finette Wi-Fi. Below that is a Bluetooth um, indicator. You should probably have Bluetooth disabled. Below that, uh, I have my recording, but you're not going to see that. You should see the volume indicator here. So you can use this slider to turn up the volume on your Chromebook or Chromebox. I have a microphone plugged in, so I have this message telling me that I have some sort of USB device plugged in. Below that, you'll see your settings button. If you click here, you will access all the Chrome settings for your device. And next to settings, you're going to see a battery life. So I have 75% battery, and I have about 2 hours and 56 minutes left. Uh, below this, you have the date. If you click here, you can change the date and time. Next to that is a really nice button, uh, a question mark for help. If you tap on the help button, it will give you the Chrome help screen. So if you get stuck with something, you have this search bar, and you can go in and figure out something that you need help with. So it will give you a list of suggestions to help you with your Chromebook or Chromebox. Next to the help is the power off button. If you're on a Chromebook, you should have a shutdown button. If you're on a Chromebox, you're also going to have a power button. Uh, normally, you probably won't need to shut these down, but if you do, you can also get to the power button from the settings menu. Next to the power is the lock button. If you click on lock, it will sign you off of the account and it will lock it so that you have to enter your password to open back up the Chromebook. So those are the Chromebook and Chromebox settings on Chrome OS.